Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to upgrade and or install a Pentium 4 CPU in your socket um, 478 computer. So, the first thing you'll need to do is you'll, you'll need, if you've got a Dell or Dimension 1, you'll need to lift the screen cover up. So you just pull it forward slightly like that so it comes loose and you pull it up like that. And then the next thing you'll find is the CPU socket in there. Which is where you're going to install your CPU yourself. Um, I've just taken myself to show you how to do it so that it's easy to do. So, what the first thing you need to do is you need to lift, lift this zip thing over here, this old metal comparison to the last one, which was um, brown. So, you need to lift it up like that, push it all the way it can go, and then you need to get your CPU. So, we've got a Pentium 4 here. I've already got the grease on it because the Toddy was just doing it for demonstration. So get all the pins lined up. So you see that little notch in the top um, on the CPU here. We need to line that up with the um, notch on the motherboard which is over that corner there as you can see. So you need to line that up on the motherboard like that. And so when it's in line it should just lock in place like that. And then the next thing you'll do is you'll need to push this back down. Let's turn it a little bit harder. On this one it's not so hard but you Push it down so it clicks under there, and then once you've done that, you'll need to get your heating. So you've got to make sure you've got a heating. You know, you've got to make sure you've got your thermal paste underneath that so that you can um, see it can work so that you don't know the heat CPU. So I've already got mine um, applied. You can get it quite cheaply off eBay if you want some. Um, so the next thing you'll do is you you line this up here, so you see the notch on the side there. You need to line it up under this under this catch there. Just if you can see, I don't think you can, but there's a notch under there. There you can see it. And then you push that down, and then when you come around to this side, you'll see there's another knot. And then you to push it through that, so it clicks like that. And then that's it, you've just you just installed it, I suppose. And then the next thing you do is you need to, um, if you've got a bell, put this on top. Like that, because the fan here inside here, you could collect all the heat out of it. So that's how you install some CPU in, in the Dell or same way as in a system, with a normal system, you just have a fan up. You don't need to put this over because it has a fan on your heat sink. Thanks for watching.